We spent a lot of time with architects over the last year and found ourselves saying, what if? Uh, and we did a, a fun homework assignment with them where we said, what will Windows be like five or 10 years from now? It literally started with sketches and drawings and conversations, and it's become a whole new way we're thinking about the window. Windows and Doors of the future, one of the things we joke about is there, there will still be bugs. So it's got an integrated screen within that. The concept of movement in this window is, was a new take for us. Not worrying about how does it fit in terms of being a classic like double hung or a, a casement, but instead sitting back and saying, what's the best way to leverage movement to bring the best experience to the consumer, but also to give them the best view? What you're seeing here is, is what we call an in-plane sliding window. And I think you'll continue to see uh, less meaning more, right? People want to see those sight lines. They want those clean lines. Safety is still important. We've incorporated that into this window. But overall, we think about bigger expanses and the ability to play with automation. And it's not the, the sake of doing automation to say you've done it. It's how is it going to make it easier for that homeowner and how they interact and live with their home. And, and things like knowing when you're going to come home at night and allowing it to breathe and ventilate the house and things like that. So those are a couple of the aspects we look at and say, we're excited about the future and what it can entail. Now I'm going to demo Pella's new future concept window. I'm going to push open on the app. And you'll notice the top edge of the lower sash starts to tilt in like a hopper. And then the window goes from the bottom all the way to the top. We've integrated a roll screen tucked away into the sill and attached to the bottom of the lower sash. Go ahead and close it. And it just tucks itself right back in for that nice all glass appearance.